how to connect Printful to Shopify. Good day and welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to show you how to connect your Shopify store to your Printful account. Now if you're unfamiliar, Shopify is an e-commerce platform which allows you to create and set up a store that is unique to you and you can ship items that you sell anywhere in the world of course it comes at a cost you will need to pay shipping or integrate it into your pricing but the diversity and the opportunity is absolutely endless so let us jump straight in your printful account basically allows you to create designs either print or embroidery and you can throw them on a bunch of products from business cards to signage to clothing items shoes for ladies men's children whatever it is cups pens all of these things that you can print on and it's all done from one site and the best thing about it is you don't have to run around physically and go and source product and go and find a printer and go and find a courier service or whatever the case may be that you need to get your product to your customer it's a fantastic platform because all you do is in a couple of clicks you can create a design and it does the rest for you in a matter of days your customer will have their product in their hands and you you can just do it from your computer so I'm going to show you how to integrate a Printful account with a Shopify store. So first of all, you're going to need a Printful account. And if you haven't got one, you can create one for free on Printful.com. Then the second thing you want to do is create a Shopify store. Now, once you have created a Shopify store, which is also free, all you need is an email address and a password. And you can set it up what it's going to do is it's going to ask you a bunch of questions to try and define what kind of store you have or what kind of store you will have and then once you have set up all of these things you can link these two platforms together so this is what the shopify store homepage looks like and on the left hand side you've got a toolbar you can manage your orders your products your customers the content your analytics marketing all your discounts and then you have sales channels you have the online store and then you have a point of sale and then right underneath that you can connect some apps but this is how we're going to do the integration we're going to go into printful.com and on the left hand side there is a toolbar now if you run down the toolbar you will see a tab called stores once you're in stores, you will be able to choose from a bunch of different platforms to connect to your Printful account. So let us run down and it says here, choose your stores platform. And we're just going to tap on choose platform. Then you will see it is actually the very first store on the list of stores. And it says Shopify platform, e-commerce platform with everything you need to sell online so all you're going to do here is tap connect and once you've connected you will get into this page so it's very easy it says create your shopify account install the printful app on shopify connect your store and add your products it's a very simple process so if we go down this page you'll see a get the app tab and we're going to just tap on that now it'll open a new window and this is the app.shopify.com forward slash printful so this is the app store that shopify offers and you'll see that the app is over here on the left hand side before we actually install the app it gives you a bunch of information about the app so that you know exactly what it is that you're actually installing so everything that you need to know including pricing reviews and so forth so now all we have to do is tap add app and once we've done that it'll bring you into the tab where you can actually choose your account now if your initial account is not displayed on this page you can add a new account 
However, we are just going to tap this existing account and it's going to automatically integrate our Shopify and our Printful accounts. So this is now back into the Shopify app and you can see here it says Printful, print on demand and it's showing you the integration. It's your store and the Printful integration. It also says this this app needs to access customer and store information and edit customer and store information. So basically you can read their data privacy and their developers privacy policy. It gives you all the information as to what it can actually access and so forth. So right at the top on the right hand side, you can either cancel this operation or you can say install app. The next page it brings you to is the integration of your accounts and on the top left hand side it gives you the opportunity to sign in with the email address that you've chosen. If it is not the right email address you have some options down over here you can sign in with Facebook, with your Google account, Apple ID or just with an email address. We're just going to tap continue with the original email address that we have and then it says confirm connection and we are going to connect the store. And it's as simple as that. Here you are back in your Printful dashboard. And on the left hand side, again, you can tap stores. And you will actually find that your store has now been integrated into the Printful store catalog. So again, what you can actually do here is it's showing you your activity, the status it's showing your billing information and your selling region and then what you can do from here is you can view the store and you can also add a product now before you actually start selling products you need to add a product and that is what happens in the printful dashboard so you're going to jump into on the left hand side your product templates have a look through what templates there are and then integrate your designs onto those templates and start selling now let's say perhaps you want to remove the store from Printful. All you have to do is tap on the actual store and it'll bring you into a page with a bunch of information. On the right hand side you can tap settings and this is where you can define everything about your store including your store's name, the URL, you can also change the region, the selling region, the delivery time requirements, and then right at the bottom, you can actually remove the store. So all you have to do is tap remove, and you've got to understand that what it says here is removing your store will completely remove all contents associated with it. There is no way back. Please be careful with this option. So make sure that this is a final decision to actually remove the store because the integration and the content that has been created in between these two platforms will actually be removed if the store is removed. So be careful with that one. And there you go. Now you can start building your store. You can start creating products, designing some prints and some embroidery, and you can actually start making money. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to leave us a like and we'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.